Hi everyone, long time no see. Um, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I know I've been MIA for a while and I've had a few um, people text me asking me if I'm okay. And yes, I'm okay. I've just been extremely, extremely busy. Um, I did have some family things going on for a little while, but then after all of that got situated, I was just still extremely, extremely busy with work. Excuse me. Um, so I just, I had no choice. I had to take a break. Um, and some weeks I wasn't even decorating my spreads. Like, um, I mean, sometimes I was <clears throat> like my work planner. I was just getting a quick, um, you know, throw down some stickers on it so I can, you know, stay in, because if I don't, I feel like if I don't decorate my work planner, I am completely unorganized. So I was, um, you know, just throwing down some stickers really quick and that way I can stay, you know, with the flow. Um, but like my vertical planner, I really wasn't keeping up with some most weeks. So, um, yeah, I have felt lost. Um, but anyway, I am here this week for the week of September 2nd through the 8th in my classic vertical happy planner. Um, this is our catch all, like everything to do with our live planner. So, um, and Saturday and Sunday, my twins will be 20 years old on Saturday and Sunday, my youngest will be 15 and my granddaughter will actually also be a year old. Um, I know it's weird to say I have a granddaughter, but anyway, um, so I'm going to do a birthday spread. I was thinking about doing like a baby birthday spread because it's her first birthday. Um, but I don't know. Um, it's really hard to find stickers suitable for boys. I mean, there's a whole lot of stickers out there for girls' birthdays, but it's really hard to find some for boys. So I have Birthday Basics by Kelly the Plan, and I have a few of these larger stickers left um, that I might, well, that I'm gonna use. So, um, and I have a Labor Day sticker and a No School sticker sitting here for Monday. Um, shoot, I need to grab JoJo's rainbow boxes really quick. Hold on. Okay, because I don't have very many boxes in this set left and I'm going to need a long box. So, let's see what color long box I have left in this sticker book because I've used it quite a bit. Uh... Let's see, I have an orange one. Okay, let's just, yeah, let's do orange. Okay. Let me light out this over here. <clears throat> Oops. sidebar sticker over there and I want to put this large cake over in the corner <clears throat> okay now, I got that down and I put some white out around the box too so it didn't like, you know, come through. But anyway, all right, so let's see. I want, I want to do a box for Labor Day and the No School. Um, let's see. Oops. Maybe I'm gonna do yellow. I was thinking about putting red, but if I did red, it would be like right next to that orange and it's 
too similar of a color. So let's do a square and then I put Labor Day here. It's like a cat hair or an eyelash one on there. It's gonna bug me. Okay, and no school. Right there. Okay, and then let's see. I don't think we have anything on Tuesday. Wednesday, I have a dentist appointment. So, let's see. I'll put... You find something to layer with this. I never use these decorative boxes. And sometimes I'm like, you know, I wonder why I don't use these boxes. I really should. Oh, let's see. Since it's really not that busy of a week. I'm going to put this kind of offset a little bit. I'm not going to put it like perfectly in the box. And it kind of looks crooked, but oh well. Okay. And then I'm going to kind of layer this one over it just a little bit. And maybe do one of these little curlies kind of lift up the corner put it right there all right let's put a couple of bullet points down here before I get too far ahead of myself um Put a couple here. And let's see if I have any more of this color. Yes, I have one. Okay. So let's see. Um I want to find a quote. Where were the quotes? I think they're in the front of this book. Okay, this quote says, We age not by years, but by stories. I wonder if I put it here. If I put it here, I kind of feel like it's like right under the hat. All right, I'm gonna figure out where I wanna put my dentist appointment box though. So let's go back to the boxes here. I don't really wanna make it too big and boxy. I really don't know about putting this here because it'll be right across from that big sticker. I'm gonna put it there anyway. And then, let's see. I can do this blue. Kind of layered a little right here. And let's see. What do I want to put here? All right, let's put this 
banner. I'm going to white out the line that goes right in between. Okay, and I think maybe put the quote right here. Okay, so for this half of the week, uh, we've got football game, football game, football game, and the birthdays. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, how do I want to do this? Okay. So we've got these birthday stickers. Already like birthday already in them. Um, maybe. Okay, so I'm gonna go off the lines on the on here so I make sure I layer these straight. And then we've got numbers back here. Which my youngest and my granddaughter share a birthday. So I don't know. But we can do 15. And then the twins. Twins are going to be 20. All right. It's, it, it's crazy that I have three birthdays that are, you know, my kids right back to back. And really, Honestly, they would have all had the same birthday, um, but the year my youngest was born, the twins' birthday happened to land on Labor Day that year, so we could not schedule the C-section on Labor Day, so we went in the next day, which was the 8th, so that is why. But, had it not been on Labor Day that year, they would all three have the same birthday. Anyway, I'm gonna white out this line. Okay, well, I'll wait for that white pen to dry underneath the, the top right there. I'm gonna go ahead and put this one down. I'm gonna put it down here at the bottom. That way we have a little spaced out, not so crammed together. And let's white pen this one. Okay, so I got these down and I have this, it says cheers to the birthday boy. I wish I, it said boys, but whatever. I might, I don't know, I might put this down somewhere like in between but I also have other things I need to put down for Saturday and Sunday so I don't know if I'm gonna put that down at all yet but anyway um for Thursday I'm just gonna put down some 
bullet points because um, I don't have anything for Thursday. And so let's see, where do I want to put them? Um, hmm. Okay, I could put them at the top. No, wait. Not sure where I want to put them for a Friday. Actually, I don't know. Let's just put them at the top. I would like to put another quote down here on Thursday somewhere though. It says happy, happy, happy candle blowing, wish making, cake eating day. Mm. Okay, I think I'm gonna put it down here at the bottom. That way. Oops, I need to bring it over just a little. Yep, all right, and then I'm gonna white out the line in between. All right, while I wait for that to dry, I'm gonna get my box for Friday. And the reason why I left this open is so I can layer a decorative box. Um. <clears throat> I don't have much of this color. So let's put this down. Okay, and then <clears throat> there is a high school football game on Friday. All right, I think I'm going to use orange from JoJo's boxes here and put it like this okay and then I'm gonna put this down now that it's pretty much dry I'm gonna put this down here white out that line in between it though okay the Saturday football game and Sunday game I'm so excited for NFL to start and college football started last week so I'm um, like I love watching football. Football season is my fave. So, anyway. Um, all right. Let's take this red one. Man, I feel like it's a lot of red, though. And this blue one. Hmm. Hmm. All right, maybe we can, I don't know. We're going to, I'm going to have to separate this somehow. Uh, all right, maybe. Maybe put one of these down. All right, wait a minute. And this is what wax paper is for. Okay, so I could put this down here. And do <clears throat> the red for Saturday. And 
Let the blue kind of overlap in this way a little bit. And let's see. Maybe put this a little curly underneath it too. Okay, I think I am gonna take this Cheers to the Birthday Boy. And put it right here. Let's put this other present down here in the bottom corner. I'm just going to use my white out for the lines so it's faster. I should have used some washi. I have this blue stripe from Live Love Posh. I think I'm gonna put across the bottom here. Whoops. Fix that. Okay. And then let's go to this side. Oops. <laughs> For whatever reason, I can't hold on to it. And I'm going to cut right around this present like it goes up underneath it. Like that. Okay. Um... We've got this blue curly Q thing. Um, all right, yeah. Well, maybe. See, I got one right there. Yeah, I think I'm gonna add this hat right here. And then put this one over here. And maybe this present. Right here. I don't know. I don't know if I particularly like that right there. Maybe I won't put this present down. Okay, I think that's good though. So, let me put this away. Yeah, I think that that looks, that looks good. I like, 
I used to layer these like decorative boxes, not so much from Kill of a Plan, but like Happy Planners decorative boxes. I used to layer them like this all the time. And then I don't know, I just quit doing it for whatever reason. But um, this turned for what little tiny bit of stickers I had left in this set, it actually turned out to be um, pretty good. So this is my spread in my classic vertical happy planner for the week of September 2nd through the 8th. It is um, three of my kids' birthday, um, using Kelva Plans Birthday Basics. This is volume one. Um, there was some stuff on volume two that I thought about using, but volume two is very little bit of stickers, like, in each set, so I don't know. But anyway, I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please hit the like button. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!